I would say this book is mainly about trying to take a different perspective on what, you know, on the mundane world, I suppose. Like, I guess, you know, I was just in a field with some goats, essentially, but the reason it became kind of special, for me at least, was, you know, I was on four legs, kind of at the same, like, eye level, at breath level, with these kind of animals, and it's not, you know, eating, you know, just experiencing the world with my mouth, and it's kind of, um, yeah, it's not, a, it's, you know, it's a different perspective on the same scene. So a goat's breath is like this sort of deep kind of, it's like, you know, those kind of big bags of, which farmers have, like of, you know, like a big kind of, pile of rotting hay you know grass and you just it's like if you kind of put your head inside one of those bags and like breathed in that would be like a goat's breath like real sort of silage yeah mm. this book is called goat man and which means goat man in norwegian and um yeah it's a book I wrote about a project I did to try and become a goat.